Hi everybody. Uh, yes, the sound is back. I think we're gonna check that out real quick, and then we're gonna do this week's video. Hey everybody. Um, I just want to do a quick video about um, something I watched last night. I posted this on Facebook last night because it was. It was important to me right after I watched this video. I watched it a couple times. And it was a girl in a singing competition in, in Germany. Um, and uh, she dressed and sounded different and acted different. Um, she used the words other, literally other than. Um, she said, I look other, I act other. And um, yeah, definitely not your stereotypical teenage girl and uh, it just reminded me of how I remember feeling other than um, in my serious days of trying to walk like a Christian and talk like a Christian and uh, there were people in my church that I really felt they were they, they obviously had it down they were ha they, they were happy so they must have been doing it right or something because I felt very not right. I and I, it made me feel at first less than. And uh, but um, the people who used to give their testimonies about how they were once less than, it was all because they had problems. They um, changed something in their behavior. They used to. Uh, they used to drink, smoke, listen to rock and roll, whatever. And then they found Jesus and found the light and they, and they got rid of all that. And I was like, well, the, at least they could find a fix. But I couldn't find a fix for what I felt less than about because it was about me personally. And I felt very inadequate and uh, I thought there was something wrong with me. And But I knew I was unfixable. Um, that's when I really started seeking out um, what was really true about what I was believing because I was really serious about it and I took it to heart and the more I was finding grace and when I finally found grace and I and I, I had this epiphany about um, how I judged everything as good or bad everything in my life was good or bad people places things events occurrences moments I I I was just programmed in my in my religious thinking to judge it when I stopped judging altogether uh, neither calling anything good nor bad. Um, I, I, real, I started understanding what Paul said grace was. Um, I literally had to throw the, my biblical law out. And, I, and then I remembered what Paul said about that. It was nice because, you know what? This gospel of grace and peace, it's for everyone. And everyone is other than. Wonder know why I say that? Because nobody's greater than anybody else. Nobody's less than anybody else. And everybody truly is unique and other than. So this gospel is for you. If you feel other than, <laughs> you're on your way. Have a revolutionary week.